a hundred years from now, when people look back and say, what the heck happened in 2020? Why? This is part of the history, part of the material culture, and then the stories that go along with it. Stories of injustice, community, and hope are what these pieces of art symbolize. It felt like one giant outdoor museum, but also a community gathering. Representing a time that'll forever be etched in history. The murals are important, but even more important for the History Museum are the stories behind the murals. That's why the Greensboro History Museum is placing them in their gallery, freezing these artifacts in time. Some of these boards will be in our permanent collection on display, and some as part of an upcoming exhibit this fall called North Carolina Democracy. And for one artist whose work was chosen as part of the upcoming display, I am Greensboro history now. Marshall Lakes recreated an original photo by Kevin Green showing a black man and young white girl holding hands during a protest. If I couldn't paint that, I wasn't going to paint. Getting permission from the artist to recreate the image that's now gone viral. For Marshall, his artwork that will now be seen in the museum, well, it feels like an accomplishment he's long awaited. When I actually walk in a museum and I see that piece, then that will be the thing that goes like, wow. And while he wants the community to feel his message through his work, there's one person he hopes is especially impressed. Take my mom to go see it. That'll be awesome. You know, she'll, she'll be like, she'll be justified in supporting my career. <laughs>